Alright guys, on this one we've got the Dyson 54 ball, as you can see here. The um, Cyclone canister needs cleaning. These tend to have a lot of dirt build up inside, so I'm going to have a look at that today. Uh, as you can see here, I'm just removing the canister from the um, Hoover unit. And firstly, we're going to start to dismantle it. Uh, if you press the red button, release the bin, there's a little grey tab, press that in. And uh, if you just pull the bin off of the cyclone unit, as you can see I've done here. Now there are nine screws on the outside of this unit, on the outside. So here you can see me just undoing them with the Torx key or Torx screwdriver and I've done undone all nine screws around the sides here to show you this just taking this outer filter off just put that to the side for a minute and there's a seal for the canister take that off as well uh, inside here there's six screws six torque screws they're all the same all the same size and um, I'm just going to undo them also and I've undone all six screws and just pull this section off as you can see there's a lot of dust built up inside in this cone section so I'll just take this gasket off here or it's not a gasket it's a bottom end of one of the cyclones one of the tips. Let's take that off and just show you inside there. It's a bit messy. Looks like plaster or something. So that section's off. Now we come to this section here. Now there's a further six uh, screws here, the countersunk. And uh, it may be difficult to get to on some because um, you get a lot of dirt build up inside here. You can't actually see the screws. And I've undone the six screws, the six torque screws here. Then I'm just going to remove this section, the middle cyclone, and attached to that is this section here with a red gasket. Let's separate that. And here you can see me just removing the gasket. I'm going to give the whole thing a wash. Just carefully uh, peeling the gasket away from this um, section here. Let's put all these parts over here for now. And let's show you inside here. It's all the dust falling out. Now to this section here, there are seven torque screws, six around the outside, the one in the middle. And I'm just doing them all, undoing the torque screws here. Like I say, they can be difficult to get to because some of them get covered in dust, you can't see it. And it's just a matter of separating it, the little tab to open the bin. You've probably just got to carefully bend that out of the way to separate this section from the top section. As you can see, I've done there. You see all the dust falling out. Let's put that section over here. And all I've got to do now is remove all of these gaskets here. They just peel off like so. In this, in this section there's seven screws. Just got to undo them now. This is for the final section. And I've done all, I've done all seven screws here. So this section should just pull apart like so. You can see that's the top section separated. There's a little section inside here. So let's get rid of this dust that fell out of the unit and then uh, move on to the next stage, which will be cleaning the parts what I've just disassembled. I normally just put them in a bucket of bleach or two buckets of bleach, you'll see here. So this section, just dip that in. Just leave them to soak for about half a day or so. 
Can you see me bring the other bucket out in a second? Once I've managed to get this gasket off here. Now you can see I've got them both soaked. Obviously, like I said, it's for about half a day or so. Just to loosen the dirt, whatever dirt's inside. And now I'm going to give them a wash. I'll just take all the sections out of the bucket now. But they've been soaking long enough. It's just a matter of getting them blast, as you can see here. It's all the dirt coming off it. Off the certain sections of the cyclone unit. Just showing you this section here. There's all the dirt inside there. Most of it's gone, but it's uh, going to blast the rest of it out. Like so. This next section you'll just see me cleaning the gaskets. Took them all off, just took them on the side while they're wet. And just paint them with bleach, both sides. And once that's done, just give the whole of the cleaner blast. Get rid of all the bleach or cleaning, whatever cleaning fluid. concludes so all I'm going to do is um, just shake all the water off the parts and off the gaskets like so and I'm just going to lay everything out and leave them to dry and here you can see all the parts are dry uh, I'm going to be doing a detailed reassembly in the next video so until then thanks for watching once again and uh, please subscribe